Hello everybody and welcome to my cooking channel. What you making Dave? Today we're gonna make a very quick and easy no-bake dessert. All the ingredients are right in front of you. We have some banana pudding that I've made earlier. We have some vanilla pudding that I've made earlier. Some lovely graham crackers by Christy. We have Betty Crocker creamy chocolate deluxe topping for the top. So we're going to hop right into this and show you how we build it. We're going to start off with the graham crackers. We're going to just put them in the bottom like this. Now here comes the fun part. If we were doing this live, I would ask everyone, what would you like to start with? The vanilla or the banana? So because we don't have a live audience here, I'm going to ask the camera crew, what should we start with? Vanilla. Vanilla it is. So we're just going to take some of vanilla and put it along the bottom. Pretty simple stuff. Now all we do is repeat the process over and over again. But this time we switch it up. We go for the banana. More graham cracker, you say. And don't forget, nothing is perfect. A little overlapping is okay.
believe this is going to be the last layer that we do on this no bake graham cracker pudding cake with some lovely creamy Betty Crocker chocolate icing. What we're going to do is we're going to put the crackers on now, the last of the crackers. And uh, what I've counted was a camera crew and I ate a couple of the crackers before we started filming in. Well, guess what? We don't have enough crackers to finish it. So I'm going to do the very best I can. And remember, nothing is perfect. We enjoyed having these crackers. Uh, there's nothing wrong with having those crackers. So now we're going to take our lovely Betty Crocker creamy chocolate deluxe icing and do our best to spread it on top. And make the top of our no-bake dessert. All right, so all we're gonna do is we're gonna cover this in some plastic wrap, put it in the fridge for about 30, 35 minutes, and we're gonna pull it out, cut it, and show you exactly what this is all about. Okay, everybody, welcome back. This has been sitting in the fridge for about an hour now, and we're gonna cut a piece and see how our no-bake dessert came out. Here's the true test. Oh boy. Oh my, it seemed to cut quite well. This is uh, quite interesting. I'm gonna do different size pieces when you're serving things. Before you take your next cut, wipe your knife off so the pieces don't look dirty as you're serving them. Um, what I think I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do smaller pieces and uh, a little bit larger piece in the middle. Oh yes piece like this. Oh. oh my goodness. Oh wow. Again, don't forget to wipe the blade in between cuts. That way all your cake pieces will be really good. And uh, this is going to be so much fun trying to get this out of here. And as a joke, I'm going to call this a, um, a ghetto tiramisu or, <laughs> um, yeah, we'll do another large piece here. Oh boy. Let's do a little trick. Let's flip it this way and see how it goes. I'm going to go right in the middle, go for broke. And go right underneath. Oh no, I killed the top on this one. <laughs> okay, you can edit this out. Right? <laughs> like if you mangle the cake, I can't edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> and there you have it, our no-bake dessert. Absolutely incredible. We're just gonna use a little bit of icing sugar confectioner sugar and sprinkle it on top to make it look pretty and what I've done is I've also got a little bit of cocoa powder that I'm going to sprinkle on top as well onto the plate 
just for presentation. And voila, there you have it. One lovely no-bake dessert with graham crackers, vanilla pudding, banana pudding, Betty Crocker, deluxe chocolate icing. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget, click like, subscribe, make a comment. If you'd like to see me make something next time, don't forget to make a comment. Thanks for joining us. Now, I just have one other question. Would you like some? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Here you go.